Welcome, Aquarius. Thank you for tuning in to your horoscope for January 1, 2024, on your channel, Zodiac Attraction. Discover what the future holds for you in terms of finances, lucky numbers, love, health, work, family, compatibility, and favorite color. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on daily updates. Get ready to explore your destiny. Let's get started. Hello, dear Aquarius. How are you on this beautiful day? Today, we will explore messages that will reveal possible obstacles on your path to abundance. If you are looking to attract money or that special person, this message is for you. In the reading, it is pointed out that you are holding on to past stories, which is hindering your progress. The Six of Swords card reversed indicates resistance and a lack of belief in yourself. Additionally, the reversed Six of Cups suggests limitations that you still maintain. Remember that you are guided by your higher self, like a player guiding an avatar in a video game. You don't need to solve everything, you simply must realign yourself with your inner guidance. The key is to relax, allow and receive. Stay in a state of peace and comfort, without obsessing or forcing things. Current energy shows a tendency to focus excessively on the past or current situations. Disconnect from the desired results and avoid generating negative energy with repetitive thoughts. The lesson is to remember, I relax, I allow, I receive. The immediate availability of abundance for you is highlighted. You just need to relax, allow your energy to flow easily, and receive what is meant for you. Avoid carrying unnecessary weight, trust that new opportunities are lining up for you right now. Your unicorn message suggests decluttering in all areas of your life to open the door to new opportunities. Unconditional acceptance, as mentioned in the angel's message, will inspire you to reach your full potential and uplift others. Focus on the present moment before connecting with the digital realms, dear Aquarius, as the Cancer Moon aligns with Mercury Retrograde, Mars, and Neptune. These vibes pair well with appreciating all the beauty surrounding you, though your screens could distract you from these themes. Bring more structure to your afternoon routine when Luna aligns with Venus and Pluto, and consider working under the radar if it's been difficult to fight off distractions. Avoid jumping to conclusions when Mars and Neptune square off, bringing a confusing energy to the table. Harmonious vibes flow when the moon enters Leo, activating your softer side. You have had a good exposure to new things in life. Just be prepared to face the challenges coming across your way. Be ready to explain whatever you are being questioned. Your efforts will last for long and will lay a solid foundation for better progress. Do not forget to revitalize and pamper yourself amidst all this. More might be the merrier today as lively Mars and outgoing Mercury meet in your community-minded 11th house. But there's a plot twist, Mercury is retrograde, which means one bad actor could spoil the entire cast. If you have even the slightest intuitive hit to leave someone off the chat thread, follow it. You can always apologize later if they find out about the gathering and feel excluded. If you're looking for a co-conspirator on a new project, this mashup can shine a light on a potential partner. Look through your existing contact lists since a past collaborator could be the perfect fit. You see what you most value more clearly than usual early today, dear Aquarius, improving relationships and money sense. You might thoroughly enjoy setting goals for yourself or coming up with fabulous business ideas or terrific strategies for long-term plans. Good energy is with you for making the most of situations and your resources. Today also brings Venus into harmony with your sign. This cycle will continue until January 23rd, putting you in a good position to connect with like-minded people. Friends can bring more pleasure into your life, perhaps because they're more receptive or available. On another level, you can find more enjoyment in coming up with new plans, ideas, and goals for more fulfilling, happy activities. It's an excellent time to network, experiment, and explore your rebound to learn more about your tastes and needs. You have a healthier relationship with your need for pleasure, joy, and friendship in the weeks ahead. 
In short, Aquarius, this is a time of expansion and positive change. Relax, flow with life and prepare for new opportunities. Release old beliefs, keep an open mind and open yourself to receiving the magic that the universe has in store for you. Keep shining. Today's tarot reading for your sign. Letter of the day for Aquarius, Ariel's horse. This card suggests the presence of a trustworthy and loyal person in your life. It may represent someone young and organized, possibly a close friend or family member. The energy of this card indicates that this person is committed to your well-being and can offer valuable guidance. Additional card, the Nine of Swords. This card may signal some anxiety or worry in your mind. You may be magnifying a situation and experiencing insomnia because of it. The letter suggests that talking about your concerns with someone you trust can ease the burden and help you find solutions. Tarot Advice, The Two of Wands The energy of the Two of Wands urges you to talk about your concerns with someone close to you. It is time to plan and organize carefully to overcome any challenge. Open communication will allow you to find the right path and move towards your goals. Overall, this reading highlights the importance of open communication and careful planning. Take advantage of real opportunities that arise, seek advice from people you trust and maintain a positive attitude. There may be difficult decisions, but focus and dedication will lead you to success. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and luck. Think about what you value before diving into something new, Aquarius. Your value system will play a crucial role in networking, social media, and professional aspirations when Mars in Sagittarius squares Neptune in Pisces. If you just go forward with nothing in mind, then it might be challenging to focus on the right opportunities. Think of this square as your cosmic cue to figure out what you want to go after or achieve. You may value long-lasting connections, social media engagement, and opportunities that led to your dreams. Following these values will set you up for success in the long term. Things may be a bit rocky but you have the potential to sort through everything in a way that is beneficial for you in the future. Try not to let negative thoughts get on top of you. The more you breathe, sit back and analyze from a distance, the better you will feel overall. Discussing plans and options with others can be very helpful. The more you talk about what is bothering you, the better you will come to terms with things, and the more likely you are to find good solutions. The tarot gives you your lucky number. Your lucky numbers for January 1st are 21, 15, 46, 37, 44, 29. Daily Love Put on your cosmic headlights today, Aquarius. Danger and adventure could be afoot. This is because sweet Venus, our goddess planet of romance and pleasure, will be linking to powerhouse Pluto, the most intense of all planets. On the one hand, this could bring a whirlwind of passion and pleasure if you are tied to a significant other, allowing you to set time aside for insatiable sex and experimentation. However, because Pluto is in your solar 12th house of karma, it could also signal that if you are tempted into a seduction, it could come back to bite you later. Are you willing to do the necessary work that a relationship requires in order to actually thrive and succeed? The moon is in Cancer and in your sixth house. People quite often want relationships to be easy and go smoothly without actually having the willingness to put any real effort into making things work. Your romantic life, just like any other area of your life requires that you dedicate your time, energy, and love to it. It is the way that you interact with your partner in your daily life that establishes the long-term nature of your partnership with them. This is a great time to reflect on whether you can afford to devote more of yourself to doing the practices that allow you to have a fulfilling and happy relationship. At work. Depression and hardships are indicated at the work front. However, if you have managed to learn from previous experiences, you will be able to deal with these quite easily. It is necessary to draw from your own knowledge of the past. 
Timely application of this knowledge can take your career very far at this position. You also need to take decisions quickly for them to be effective. How disciplined are you in the way you go about your work? Are you able to maintain the focus necessary to take care of and manage all the details that need tending to? These are all questions to ask yourself today as the moon is in Cancer and in your sixth house of work and daily routine. Observe your relationship to those aspects of your work. Observe if one of your habits is putting things off until they accumulate and you end up falling behind and feeling overwhelmed. If that's true, create a schedule and lists for yourself that will help you stay on top of things. Health. Take adequate protection against cold and viral infection and other infections of the respiratory system. You have been exposed to a polluted atmosphere for a long time and this will now take a toll on you. Try alternative preventive measures and home remedies to keep away the infections as they are likely to be more successful. Modifying your lifestyle can be beneficial now. This transit is a great time for Aquarius to focus on their relationships with others. Take time to connect with loved ones and build meaningful connections. To balance the energy, engage in activities that promote creativity and self-expression, like writing or painting. Aquamarine or Celestite can be helpful crystals for Aquarius, promoting communication and emotional balance. Family and Friends Your old sweetheart is trying to be a new one. You must give them a chance and appreciate their efforts to reconcile the differences between the two of you. However, make them fully aware of the mistakes they have committed in the past and that they are no more allowed to repeat the same. You've had to put your desires on the back burner for quite some time now, Aquarius, and it wouldn't be at all surprising if you're starting to feel more than a little burnt out on all the brass tacks and hard facts of life. Yes, you've learned a lot and taken a lot in, but a little bit of pleasure wouldn't kill you and it's what you deserve at the very least, isn't it? A fresh opportunity for excitement and pleasure is indeed coming your way, and the wonderful thing is that you get to define what it is and manifest it yourself. If this looks like a romantic relationship or merely something physical it's time to start clarifying your desires because the universe is getting ready to meet you halfway so do your part and get ready to meet it halfway as well. What do you want? The universe wants to know. Compatibility. At work Aries. In love Virgo. In luck Scorpio. Your lucky color today. Red wine. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.